happy people i'm back with another video and today i'm super excited about this haul i have been seeing this brand all over the internet all over instagram tiktok youtube you name it it's been there and it's none other than timu yes you guys um i actually signed up for their influencer program and so my package arrived it's actually been here for a couple of weeks now i've just been traveling um and um really caught up with work and so now i'm having an opportunity to finally unbox it everything but okay you all i wanted to tell you all a little bit more about timu this is their website and you all timu is essentially amazon but their prices are so affordable it's insane like super super affordable everything that i'm going to be showing you all in this haul today was under 50 dollars like insane prices and so i'm going to go through and show you all each individual item um and then i also have a discount code with timu i'm i am going to leave that here on the screen as well as in the description box below and as i show you all items i'll be sure to include prices yeah let's hop into this haul yes y'all it's this orange package y'all know when y'all see this orange package that it's all about timu so um yeah i'm excited to show you guys the goodies that i got i did get mostly nail supplies um so yeah let's uh uh, let's get into her let's get her done okay let's see what i got i don't even remember what i purchased y'all i try to get a little bit of everything that's all i remember Ooh, okay all right so i'm gonna just put this over to the side and then i'll be pulling out items as i go but yes i also want to say thank you to timu for sponsoring this video because that's really exciting so let me go ahead and zoom in a little bit for you guys this is the first item that i got and it is a storage a clear storage box and i actually got this let me get it open for you guys yes okay so this is the item that i got um i actually got this because i saw lisette um lisette's gel nails i saw lisette store her um old um practice nails in here and so she would store them like on these little tiny tabs and then she would put them in here and just line them all up so i thought that was really cool so i got this just for the option of being able to store my um my old sets and then um you know you can also set it up too once you get everything in there for display so i just thought that was pretty cool so i picked this up and i think this was under and I think this was under a dollar, so a great steal. I also picked up the same thing, but just in a smaller size, okay? Um, so, same idea. So, same idea. I just got it to be able to store old practice nails in here. And I like having a big one and a small one, because the small one I could maybe uh, travel with. Um, you all know that I sell press-on nails, and so... Um, this would be cool maybe if I'm doing like a vendor event or something like that. I can, you know, have my press on nails on display like this. Um, so, yeah, loving these two containers. Also with these, you can store different things like charms, nail supplies, nail tools, nail art brushes, you name it. And it's nice because it's clear and so you can see exactly what's in it. So, I might actually go back and get some more of these. Um, but yeah, both of these were under a dollar. Okay, I also picked up some full cover nail tips. I definitely wanted to see how their full cover... I definitely wanted to see how their full cover nail tips were. So, let me open this up. And I think I got the medium square. So let's see. Okay. Yeah, they're of decent quality. So this is what they look like. This is the thumbnail. Yeah, I like it's thinner at the um, base of the nail and then thicker at the tip, which is really nice. When you bend it, it doesn't create that white mark. I forget what people say about that, but <laughs> I don't know if it's good or bad, but it's there. And then, yeah, it looks like a really nice fit for the nail, too. These are super cute. Oh, I like these. I think they were a dollar and some change, but that's a really nice fit for a full cover tip. I do like these a lot. So that is nice. Pick this up. I did pick up some more full cover tips, too. I wish they had these in clear, but these are some really short stiletto nail tips. And um, I got them because I didn't have any. Yeah, let me get a zero. I got them because I didn't have any, but I thought they would be really cute. I have like half tips like this, but I didn't have any full cover tips like this. So I wanted to get some. Let's see how they fit. So this is what the nail tip looks like. Pretty good. 
and sharp enough. Um, I can't say that I like these though. I don't like that it has that little curve in it, you know? Uh, that was what me, making me wish I had bought something else. But this is what the nails look like um, on the nail. It's still a good fit overall, sidewall to sidewall. Well, not really actually. Doesn't really fit sidewall to sidewall either. It kind of angles in a little bit too far. But who knows, I might be able to make it work. And if not, I can always use them for my press on nails. So I got this. So this one actually comes with 600 pieces. So I also picked this up. I don't remember what this Oh, cotton swab holder. Okay. Yay. Okay, I'm happy to have this. So this is a cotton swab dispenser. So what you do is. So I really like this. So I got this for my bathroom actually, and this is just a cotton swab dispenser. Um, it was a dollar and some change, so I definitely had to pick it up. I also picked up some adhesive tabs. Um, again, got these for press on nails. Um, what's interesting is though, someone commented on one of my videos and they said that the Timu um, nail tabs uh, don't hold as long as some of the other ones. And so um, I wanna test these out and see how well they do. But these I think were like a buck. I did also pick up some press-on nails. These are really cute. I forgot that I had gotten these. Um, I feel like they looked a lot different on the website. Uh, like they looked more, I don't know, cool, <laughs> I guess. Um, but still cool to have these nonetheless. Let's see what all comes in the press-on kits. Okay, so it comes with um, nail tabs, cuticle stick, and a small um, file. Yeah, the design I got was very different, and these are pretty curved. They're sturdy enough, though. Mm, yeah, I don't know if I like that curve. That's a, that's a pretty deep curve right there. All right, but we have them. They're here, so I'll be trying these out at some point. Next, I picked up this little set here. It's called the Nail Prep Dehydrator Kit. Um, so I thought this was cool because it comes with a nail prep, a nail glue, and a nail dehydrator. So let's see. Yeah, so it comes with these. And I think this was only like $7. Um, so yeah, this is the dehydrator, which is always good to have dehydrators, you guys. Okay, smells just like acetone slash alcohol. So it comes with the dehydrator, and then it comes with the 401 nail glue, which is always good. So this is for doing like the Gel X method. Y'all know I love doing me some Gel X nails, so I definitely wanted to give this a try. It's from the brand Magic Armor, okay? And it looks like it's a medium viscosity, a nice slow drip there. Okay. Yeah, looks like it'll work pretty well. So I'll be excited to test that out. And then what's also cool about this kit is that it came with a glossy top coat. So I like the fact that it comes with um, pretty much everything you need to do your Gel X nails outside of the nail color essentially. Um, but honestly, you can even use this kit if you were doing like press on nails. Um, I have a press on nail series going on on my channel where I apply press on nails using different mediums and this could be a cool way. This little set for $7 would be a nice addition to have. You could dehydrate your nail, apply the nail tips and then seal in your design of your press ons with that top coat. So this is a pretty cool kit. Happy I picked this up. Again, it was like seven bucks. I did pick up one more set of press on nails. These are really cute. Again, I feel like <laughs> it's interesting um, how they have it on their website. I feel like on the website, they must have took pictures of like acrylic nails and then just recreated them as a press on set. I mean, it's still cute though, but I thought that it was gonna be like 3D flowers and stuff because that's what it looked like on the website. Um, so yeah, and this comes with the same stuff. Oh, no cuticle stick though. It comes with a nail file and adhesive tabs. I don't know the cuticle stick. No cuticle stick. That's okay. Um, and let's see how these are. I mean, they're really cute. I love the fact that it has an all bling nail. Y'all know I love me some bling. So I had to get that. That's really pretty. OMG. Yeah, that's super cute. Yeah. Yeah, that's hot. Yeah, I like that. So that's that. And then these flowers, they're still really cute. They're still really cute. It's still a really nice uh, press on nail set. But again, from the pictures, but again, from the pictures, it kind of looked like it was going to be 3D flowers. But these are nice. I like, um, I like that they're straight. 
um, they feel sturdy enough. These are really, I probably end up doing a wear test with these ones here. These are really nice. I love this design as well. Also looks like it's a pretty nice fit on the thumb. So yeah, not bad at all, not bad at all. Thin around the cuticle, thicker around the tip. Kind of what you would expect from press-ons. So yeah, I just I just love that these come with some bling. Like, okay, I'm here for it. You can't beat it. This was I think um two dollars. It was like a dollar and like some change. So that's a good deal for some blinged out press on nails. Next, I got another storage container here. So I was excited to, to find this one. This one I believe was only five dollars, you guys. And so let me show you what this one looks like. I got one previously from Shein that I really liked, and so I'm excited to have this one. Okay, yeah, here we go. So this is what this looks like. So it has all these separate compartments where you can store brushes, and then it has these little drawers here where you can take them out, but you can store different types of nail supplies. It comes with two drawers. This is nice. So the two drawers here and then it you can store some stuff on top so say if you wanted to you could store like you know different nail supplies and such here you know and then you could store I don't know like brushes here if you wanted to um, even if you wanted to store some files you could um, so it's nice that they have like the different like storage compartments and it has the little area on top where you can store some of your, I don't know, favorite base coats, top coats, and then it has these drawers where you can store even more items. So I thought this was a really good deal for just five bucks. So yeah, I thought this was a really good deal for only five bucks. I am going to leave everything that I mentioned linked down in the description box below so that if you guys want to get your hands on it, you can. Okay, happy people. So as I am getting out my next item, I just wanted to let you all know that the shipping for Timu was really fast. It was around five business days. And so far, so good. All of their products are really high quality. Definitely a lot cheaper than other websites. And one of the cool things about them is that they do free shipping and free returns. If a shipment is late, they will give you a $5 credit. So that's really awesome. And also, you guys, if you scan the QR code on the screen, you could get a $100 coupon in the Timu app. Or you could search for my get 8524 code on Timu to also get that $100 discount. So yeah, let's hop back into the rest of the haul. The next type of thing I picked up is some nail glue. Um, I really like the nail glue. These, this is also for the Gelex uh, method. Um, but I love the, oh, well that's peeling right off. <laughs> but yeah, I love the uh, nail glues that come in like the little tube. So, um, that is what this looks like. Let's take a look at the consistency here. Okay, nice fine tip applicator. Very cool. So I'll be um, testing this out to do some Gelix nails here soon. So one thing I love about Timu right off the back is that everything does come individually packaged. So I'm gonna show you guys. But I love that everything comes individually packaged, which is really nice. So I did pick up a variety of acrylics and builder gels and gel polishes and such. So I'm gonna go ahead and get all this stuff unboxed and I'll be right back. The next item that I picked up here is liquid peel off tape. So this is just liquid latex. Um, I actually don't have any of this. Um, okay, yeah. I just was curious to try it. This is typically what people would use to kind of like go around like their nails. Like say if they're doing stamping or any type of nail art that they don't want to transfer onto the skin, you just paint this around the nail. After you're done with your nail art, you peel it off. Um, and so it just creates less mess. Um, it comes in a pretty small tube. This is 5 ml, but um, yeah, I was happy to have this. Give it a try. And I'm thinking you could all also use this as peel off base coat. So I might try to use it as peel off to see how that works as well. Um, so that is why I picked this up. I did pick up a gel polish. It's, in, it's 10 ml and it's by the company called Roniki. I hope I'm saying that right. Uh, but yeah, let's take a look at this color. I believe I got a glitter. Ooh, yeah. Okay, really pretty. So I picked up a really nice gold glitter gel polish. It's really, really pretty. Kind of reminds me of Christmas almost. It's really thick though, I will say that. Um, it's thick, slightly goopy actually, but um, a really pretty color. I'm sure it'll apply just fine. So 
yeah i'll be excited to try this out i am planning on um swatching all of these colors as well everything that i got in this haul so um i'm gonna make a separate video doing that i'm gonna swatch all my gel polishes and acrylics and and um builder gels that i got so yeah i got this i did pick up a couple of more gel polishes so i like this packaging so i wanted to show you guys how that looked but it's from the company miss miss cheering i guess okay and again, another gel polish and a glass bottle is 7.5 ml. So that's a pretty decent size. And I believe I paid $2 for this one as well. Ooh. Oh, this is pretty. Do y'all see this? Wow. Oh, that's nice. It's like a milky white with a gold sheen to it. Oh, I love this. That's really pretty. Okay, I'm excited to try this out in a look. And I also picked up this color here. Okay, this packaging is cute. Hello. Y'all see this? It's like this really cute peachy chrome. I'm loving it. That is so cute. Okay, I love the packaging. Let's see what this is. Ooh. Oh, I think this might be like a, a magnetic like cat eye gel polish but it's black and it has that silver and then oh this is so pretty wow okay y'all I'm loving these two so far not bad like I said I think these were two dollars a piece so I got these I forgot to show the numbers of the colors that I got over here so this beautiful one uh, it's in a different language so I don't know what that one is but this one here is AM039 so that's from this brand and then this one here is number five three from Miss Cheering and again I'm gonna leave everything linked down in the description box below so you all have direct links to all the products that I purchased also picked up this gel polish here again I think the packaging is pretty cool so let's see Ooh, look at this Okay, let's get a moment for this bottle. How freaking adorable is this? So it ombres from pink down to this like light lavender purple. Love it. This is C17. How cute is this? I wish I had gotten more of these actually. So this is 8ml and let's see. Oh my gosh, look at this. Oh, this is pretty. Oh wow. So that's a really nice orange. I actually was looking for a really good orange. I think I found it with this. And I love too, I don't know if you all can notice, but do you all see the brush? The brush is actually rounded a bit. So that's gonna be nice for getting into grooves and crevices. I like these, oh my gosh. And the consistency is nice. It's like a, like a medium viscosity, not too thick, not too thin. Well, a little bit thicker actually. It's a little bit on the thicker side, but I actually like my gel polishes to be thick. You all see it's not dripping. So I like that. Oh man, I definitely want to pick up some more of these. I had a few of these in my cart and I wish I had to grab more, but yeah, these are really nice. Again, I was trying to just grab like a variety of different items, but yeah, I really like this a lot. Okay, next I did pick up some acrylics. And so um, the acrylic is from Re Re Reconca? Reconca? Okay, I think that's how you say it. Um, and I got the color H s3 and i actually saw along her pretty nails um do a review on these and um she did this really cute glitter set and i was like oh i gotta have those as soon as i saw these on the website i was definitely like yeah i gotta have those so let's see if i can get this open here mm, this is a really beautiful vibrant pink really really gorgeous kind of like a a purpley pink actually so yeah that's really cute and these can be used as and these can be used as dip powders or acrylic so I'm gonna touch it here to see how it is it's a little bit gritty but the color is really really pretty so yeah I'll be excited to swatch these out I am planning on swatching these with some monomer I want to see how they perform as acrylics because that's why I bought them I also picked up this solid color here from the same brand HS number six and let's see what this looks like Ooh, a really beautiful light peach color. Love this. I did some light peach nails 
Yeah, it's the same consistency, a little bit gritty. But I did some light peach nails. I'll see if I could leave um, a picture of it linked here. But they were super cute. I think I did them last summer. Or maybe they might have been some kind of almost orangey nails. But love this color on me. So I picked this up. And then I also picked up two of the um, glitter acrylics as well. Super adorable. Um, again, I saw Long Hair Pretty Nails review these on her channel. And I just had to have them. So let's take a look here. Oh, look at this, y'all. How gorgeous is this? Oops, I didn't spill some on me, but isn't that beautiful? Oh, yeah, this is probably my favorite so far. Oh my gosh. Yeah, this is gonna look so nice in a set. Oh, I can't wait to play with these. Super cute. Last one from this brand is number one. Hee -hee. And yellow is my favorite color, so that's very fitting. It's number one. Oh my gosh, do you all see this? Absolutely gorgeous, wow. I love this. Okay, I cannot wait to play around with these. I see why she was obsessed with them. This is such a pretty color. Oh my gosh, I'll take that back. This one's my favorite. <laughs> I love them all actually so yeah these are all the acrylics that I got um, again I am going to do a separate swatch video with these products so definitely stay tuned to the channel hopefully it'll be my next video that I post but yeah I'm gonna swatch all these out with acrylic as well as swatch out all the gel products that I have the next product here it's another acrylic powder and this is from OS nail mall and it's in the color pink and I, again I was just trying out a lot of different items there's no seal on this and let's see Ooh, now this one feels really smooth, okay? Yeah, this feels like a really nice powder, actually. Um, so yeah, I'll be swatching that one out here as well, but it's a really pretty pink color. Really nice, okay? And the container is pretty small, it's 15 grams. Oh, I forgot to mention, with these colors here, oh, it's also 15 grams. Now, is that right? Hmm. I don't know if I believe that, you guys. You think... <laughs> Y'all think both of these are 15 grams? I'm not sure about that one, but that's what it says on the packaging, so we'll go with it. Next, I did get this, um, it's a rhinestone glue, I believe. Um, it's called Stuck Drill Glue. And let's take a look at this. I think this is supposed to be similar to, oh, there's a, there's a brand that has like a, I think it's called Ugly Duckling. And it has like a stick it gel or something like that. I think this, I think that's what they're trying to be like here with that one. But let me go ahead and open this up. Okay, and let's see what the consistency of this looks like. Okay. Let's see what the consistency looks like here. Okay, it's a little bit more runny than I was expecting. But still nice nonetheless. Yeah, okay. So this is some more rhinestone glue that I have. So I picked this up. And then last but not least, I did pick up two builder gels. So I got it in the color clear and the color pink. So let's look at the clear first. the consistency here okay I like the consistency of this one a little bit better than the other one and it looks pretty darn clear if you ask me um, it's a little bit thicker so I'll be excited to kind of play around with this maybe try to sculpt my nails with it um, but yeah it looks like a pretty nice clear if you ask me I'll be curious to know like when I cure it if it actually cures clear or if it has a yellow tint to it I feel like a lot of times these clears um, they may look clear in a bottle but then um, when you actually swatch them out they have a little yellow tint so uh, again I am going to be swatching everything in my next video so definitely stay tuned to the channel um, and so yeah this one here is in nude pink and I forgot to mention it's from the brand Full Beauty and um, these are 15 ml. So let's open this one up. Ooh, that's pretty. I like that color. It's a nice nude. This is what the consistency is like. OK. 
Okay, pretty, pretty thick. It's a nice consistency. It's like a medium viscosity. I like it, I'm not mad at it. Alrighty, so this is everything that I hauled from Timu. This is my first time shopping this um, brand, and I must say, I'm pretty happy with everything that I got. Everything was super affordable. I don't think I paid no more than seven dollars for any one of these items and honestly this was the most expensive thing and that's because it had three different items in it but everything averaged about um three to three dollars upwards of five dollars um and so yeah the website is very affordable i feel like it's a mix between um aliexpress and shein so like if shein and aliexpress had a baby i feel like timu would be born so yeah i really like everything i got the ordering process was easy i believe my order arrived in about a week and a half and so the shipping is really fast the products seem like they're decent quality as i mentioned earlier i am going to go through and swatch everything that i hauled um so stay tuned for my next video so you all can see how these products actually perform. And I do have a discount code with Timu. I am going to leave it here on the screen as well as in the description box below in case you guys want to get your hands on some of their items. And um, I'll also leave every single item linked down in the description box below as well. Um, and yeah, I'm looking forward to testing out more of their products. So yeah, you guys, let me know. Have you all ordered from Timu? I know I'm a little late to the game. Everybody's been hauling it. Um, but let me know if you all have hauled from Timu. And what do you think? I'm loving their products, I'm loving the prices, and I'm loving the shipping. So yeah, which I would, I would say go ahead and check them out. I do upload every Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. Thursdays in particular are my Nail Therapy Thursday premieres where I tune in live with you all as you watch me do my nails. And if you all like what you saw here, definitely stick around, join the happy family. I'd love to have you. And as always, you guys, leave some love in the comments down below, and I'll see you in my next video. I hope you all have a wonderful, awesome, spectacular day. Bye!